in the name of the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit, we declare today the opening of this new thing is down. Amen. Amen. Subhan Rabbi Gara Bilizat Amai Safun, wa salatu wa salam wa alayhi wa salim. This is not about us, this is about Ghana. This is a new discovery. Post independence, all gold was actually found in the west of Ashanti. But this discovery has actually made it uh, uh, possible for us to know there's something in here that we can find. What this means is it will bridge the gap between poverty, between the south and the north. In the month of February 2023, engineers and planners, the leading mine contracting firm on the continent, clogged another milestone when it won a contract for a mine development project in a green field in the Upper East Regional Capital, Bolgatanga. Known as the Namdini Gold Project, it is the latest to be added to engineers and planners' rich portfolio of projects that the company is executing for blue chip clients. The Namdini project has a proven and probable ore reserve of 5.1 million ounces. This latest contract involves the construction of a tailing storage facility for the mine. Since the site is a green field, it requires the felling of trees to construct haul road that will pave way for easy movement of equipment and other road tracks in and out of the construction site. With a solid asset base, the experienced technical team of EMP then marshaled some heavy-duty equipment from both Daman and Takwa sites in the western region to Bogatanga in the upper east region after all the necessary recce works had been done. These heavy-duty equipment are to start the initial works of clearing the construction areas to pave way for the setting up of offices, whole road constructions and other infrastructure needed to commence the execution of the contract. Kadia Lamdin Mining Limited is exploring new grounds. Our parent company, Shandong, in China, wants this project to be a milestone in Ghana want to create the biggest surface operations and it's starting from the north here. He tells you a green field and you have been the biggest contractor now coming to site. I know there are other bigger projects coming on and as I said, if we can work safely, efficiently and with quality, I know you will be profitable. I will meet my timelines, mm. I will deliver and I can be profitable. Mm. And as we grow the business, mm. as I said, the community, mm. our host community, is our first priority as mm. part of the stakeholders. We have to bring them up from where they are as on scale level to become skillful as in the Takwa mm -hmm. region. And it will depend on us. It will depend on us because we are from diverse backgrounds. Yeah. We have diverse experience. Yeah. We know diverse cultures. Let's come and bring their culture yeah. into our experience. Help them so they can help us. Let's win together. Yeah. Let's work together to bring Shandong Kadan to a big success. For me, what gladdens me is that we are all part of the success story to be written in the future that we found good and is it of us being here will be remembered. These pictures. Our children will remember and say, Daddy, my daddy was part of it. My uncle was part of it. My brother was part of it. So I feel that let's not only look at contractual, let's look and see what difference we can make in here. To cut corners is to say, if we're given a job to do, we will go by the contract and bring what is necessary such that we save costs. We don't do that. Whatever we have available, we bring and make sure that any contractor, whether you are part of us or not with us, we can work together.
engineers and planners is looking beyond the construction of the tailing storage facility to build a stronger partnership with Cardinal Namdini for the mutual benefit of both parties. We invite you to follow us on this new journey as we bring you updates and the progress of work from the Namdini Gold Project. Engineers and planners working for the growth and development of Ghana and the African continent. Thank you.